guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. So I wanted to show you guys a few of the things that I've been picking up at yard sales recently. Uh, me and Zach went to quite a few yard sales to look for just new baby things. So I wanted to show you guys all the stuff that we found so far. There are some items that aren't baby related because you know if I'm going shopping for someone, I'm, I'm gonna buy something for myself. That's just how I am. So I'm gonna show you guys the stuff that I bought for myself first. And then I'll also show you some of the stuff that we got for free. And then I will show you all of the new baby stuff that we picked up at yard sales. I think we got some really good deals. Okay, so I'm gonna start with this item here first. Um, this is like a little cross body bag. I'm not really familiar with that brand Connections, uh, but I did pay $5 for it. I wanted something like this just because when I go to concerts or whatever, um, it'll just be easier to carry things. This is what the front part opens up and looks like. Five bucks for this, it's not bad. I really like the crossbody strap on it. Thought it was really like a really pretty neutral color. This I picked up at the same sale on this little coin pouch. Uh, I loved how it looked like a little frog. I thought it was too cute. Uh, this was only 50 cents. And then this purse right here, I already, I'm already using it. I have all my stuff in it. Did pick this up for $2. I thought it was a really good deal. Cause like I said, I really like purses with like the long crossbody strap. This one had like a little like leather piece on top. I thought it was really casual and it matches a lot of things. So I did get that for $2, such a good deal. And then I did pick up these two little planters at a different sale. Um, here, I'll just like try to hold them this way. Um, there's this one, it looks very similar to this one, just a little bit different. These were only 50 cents a piece. I thought that was such a good deal. I thought these were super pretty. I think I'm gonna put like either succulents or cactus in them. I don't know why, the, just the colors I think would go really well. So the day we got all this stuff, we were kind of just driving around to different yard sales and we were following the signs to this one sale in particular and we got all the way there and it looked like they were already closed up and finished for the day and it was kind of early it was only like two o'clock so they were already closed up and they had a lot of stuff like just sitting out by the trash so i'm assuming whatever they didn't sell they were just giving it away um, because all of it was sitting by the trash cans so i'm going to show you guys what we picked up for free um, from the yard sale that was closed down just give me one second okay so i'm going to start with this piece right here i thought this was so gorgeous so this was like a three-piece canvas set um, each canvas was marked for two dollars and we didn't even notice at first that they connected into this really beautiful picture um, it wasn't until we got home and we kind of were rearranging them that we noticed that they all like made a larger picture and I thought that was super cool. It's sitting here in my dining room on the floor because unfortunately we just don't have a wall like big enough for such a large like art piece but I'm just holding on to it because it was free and I don't know maybe someday we'll move into a house with bigger walls more space and we could make good use of this. But I just, I could not leave that behind. It was too pretty. We also found this shelf. I thought it was really cute. Um, there at the bottom, there's like a little rack uh, if you wanted to hang towels from it. Uh, but this had a sticker for $5. So I thought that was a really good find. Um, I, mean, I don't know if I'm gonna put this in the kitchen or the bathroom, but either way, I know I'm gonna make good use of it. I think it's really, really cute. Um, so I'm gonna take you guys to our nursery. Well, it's not really even started yet. We're just kind of using it for storage. And I'll show you guys the rest of the stuff that we found for free, um, the rest of its baby stuff. And then I'll show you the other baby stuff that we bought at a couple other yard sales. So this is the room that we're gonna put the nursery in. We've got a lot of work to do in here. Uh, not a lot of space, but we still got a lot of cleaning to do. But I'm gonna start with, um, these little items right here. I'll finish showing you the stuff that we got for free. Um, so there in the back, that little um, baby gate, that was um, $5 originally, but they just had it sitting outside. And then those two little booster seats, um, they both looked like they were in really good condition. I don't know if we're gonna use them or not, but we just didn't wanna leave them behind because they looked like they were in such good shape and they were free. Um, there wasn't a price on them, so I don't know if we're going to end up using these. I have to do research and see if that's even safe. 
but I mean, I think they look like they're in really good condition. They look new. So we just grabbed them just in case we could use them like in the future. The last item that we got for free was this adorable little rocking chair. I thought it was so, so cute. Uh, Zach just fell in love with it when we seen it on the side of the road. Um, but it was $10 they had it marked for. And I thought that was such a good deal for just to find it, just sitting there by the trash. Um, we, we, have to we will have to clean it up and kind of polish it up and make it look nice. Um, but I thought that would be so cute for the baby, like, in, you know, in the future. I might put like a little like stuffed animal on there just to kind of decorate the nursery. But it kind of matches the rocking chair that we already have, uh, the one that we're going to rock the baby in. So I thought it would look really cute, you know, side by side. So that was just such a good deal. I could not believe they were giving that away for free. So let me show you the rest of the stuff that we got at other yard sales. So we got this little swing uh, for $10. Um, it was $10 for the swing and then $10 for this little bag over here. It's a pack and play. It's really, really nice. I'll try to zoom in and show you like the colors, but it's like a brown and like teal color, really pretty. Um, they did 10 for each of those. So we did 20 for the pair. Um, I did wash everything already and kind of like like clean and disinfect the little frame. We haven't put batteries in to see if it works, but I mean, hopefully it does. I thought it was such a good deal. It looked brand new. And this um, pack and play looked brand new as well. So we did pick up those two items at the same yard sale that we got this little bassinet. Here we move the little rocking chair so you can see it. Um, so we got this little bassinet uh, at the same yard sale. This I believe was $10 as well. And it, it just folds up so nicely. It's just very portable and sturdy. I thought it was really nice. So if we wanna like, ha like take the baby into different rooms, it's easy to pack up and move. So we did get that at the same sale. Those items all just look brand new. So we were feeling really comfortable with buying them. I did already disinfect and clean the bedding and all the like kind of soft like material stuff like this up here. I disinfected and cleaned all of that already. Uh, the last thing I got from that yard sale was this um, like breastfeeding pillow. It's really like, it's really pretty. I liked the colors on it. Um, this was, well, it says it was $10, but they uh, gave it to us for five. It has the little like clip right here. And I thought that was such a good deal for $5. Um, I still need to clean and disinfect it, but I like that it has like the plastic covering on it to kind of, you know, help keep it clean when you're storing it. So that was a really good deal. This little tub over here, I actually got it a different sale. Uh, me and my mom went to this. Um, they gave it to us for a dollar and then they gave it. To, so pretty much I'll tell you the whole deal we got. So we got this little tub along with this. Uh, pack and play. Now this one is not as nice as the um, the one that we have over here. Just not as new and nice looking as the, uh, the other one that we found. I found this one first and it's a little difficult to put together. So um, this one, it's probably just, I'm just going to use it for travel because it is, as you can tell, a lot more compact. So we'll probably use that uh, like when we're traveling to Michigan to see family, we'll take it with. So we got that, that pack and play there with the tub and this stroller over here. Let me bring it out. I thought it was in pretty good condition. I already took apart all the pieces that I could and cleaned it really well, disinfected the frame. And I think it looks just good as new. I really, really like it. I'm gonna make sure we find a car seat that kind of um, is compatible with this. I got the stroller the pack and play and this little tub along with a bag of some clothes and toys all of this was twelve dollars just total and i'll show you guys like the little toys and clothes that we found as well um, i will tell you about this piece over here for the nursery uh, we were really fortunate because um, like i've said in past videos zach works for a furniture moving company and some of the uh, people that he was moving furniture in for, they were getting rid of this crib and they gave it to him for free. So, I mean, it does, it's not perfect. It does have a few nicks and um, like scratches here and there. Uh, but as far as me and Zach are concerned, as long as it's clean and we disinfect it and we get a brand new mattress, we really don't care like what the frame looks like. Um, this saves us so much money by getting this gently used crib for free. 
So this is part of it over here. Um, it's wrapped up in some of those moving blankets that he has from work. And then this is another piece over here. We just got to finish cleaning it and then we have to put it together. So yeah, that's what we have um, for the nursery so far for the baby in general. Uh, we have a ton of work to do in this nursery. Um, I'm probably going to do a video showing you guys like how we put everything together, like a before and after. Uh, but yeah, that's what we have so far for the baby. Oh, hi, Michonne. Hi, baby. <laughs> she likes coming in here. So now I'm going to go get the baby clothes that we found so you can see what we got. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys the clothes that I got. And I'll start with like this um, pile over here because there's not very much. Um, this all, the, the stuff I'm about to show you came with um, the tub, the stroller, and the brown pack and play. So all of that was $12 plus these clothing items. So I got this, uh, you guys, I'm a new mom, so I really don't know what some of this stuff is. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to ask my mom what it is, but or maybe you can tell me in the comments. I think this is a blanket, maybe it's a towel, I don't know, but it's, um, it's pretty big, it's like, like this is how big it is. <laughs> it's got these cute little like ducks on here. And I tried to get stuff like in gender neutral colors because we don't know what the gender is just yet. Um, but I thought this was so cute. It's um, double sided. So it has like the yellow and white stripes on one side, little ducks on the other. And then embroidered on the bottom here, it says, I love my family. <laughs> that was so cute. Um, so we got this. I thought it's really soft. I already washed everything. Um, it's just a little wrinkled. I gotta iron it out, but got this. And then I thought this matched really good with that little blanket. Uh, but I think this is like a little burp cloth. Um, it's like that terry cloth kind of material. This is what it what it looks like here. And it has this little elephant that says peekaboo. I thought that was super cute. So I got that. And then this was too precious. Um, this is a uh, nine month. It's just this little white and yellow, little like footed uh, pajama. And it says, what does it say here? Oh, love me. It has that little giraffe. I like how the little spots on the giraffe match the fabric. I thought that was really cute. And this, I think this is good for a boy or a girl. It doesn't really matter. Um, now everything else I got, I got from a yard sale um, from one of my neighbors. She lives right down the street and she has a little boy. And I'm assuming this was all of his stuff when he was little. Everything, it's kind of like more like blue and white kind of colors. Um, whether my baby, whether the gender is male or female, it doesn't really matter to me. I'm gonna use these items just because they were so affordable. So she had a big tub of like clothing items and she said, um, here's a wall, there was like a bunch of Walmart bags and she said, here, fill up a bag and whatever you can fit in there, it's $3. So I put in anything I could use for the baby, even if it was blue, if it's a girl and she's in a blue bib, oh well. <laughs> so I'll start with like the least exciting items and I'll move into my favorite items. So I got one of these little burp cloths, it's just blue and white, nothing fancy. Um, like a little washcloth with alligators on it, really cute. And these socks were super precious. They're little like white and blue little teddy bears with little like ears. I thought that was so, so cute. So I got a pair of these and then just a pair of these little gray and blue ones with the little grippies at the bottom. Thought that was super adorable. And then uh, these bibs here, I got, th I got three of them. This one right here, it's like gray with little shapes and clouds. So, so cute. This one has like a little lion on it. And this one has like a little, like a little tiger. So adorable. Oh my gosh, this is probably one of my favorites. I'm gonna save this one. I'll show you guys this one afterward. Um, I got this little swaddle here the zebras on it. I thought that was really cool. Then I, they also, I don't know what this is. I think this is a towel. I think my mom said this was a towel, um, but it's like black and white and gray and it has these little arrows on it. And it has these little like, I don't know, these little, I don't know what this is. Like, I don't know. Um, help me out in the comments what this is. <laughs> I think it's a towel, like a bath towel. 
so yeah, because like it looks like there's little like for your hands, for the hands and the head maybe. I don't know. Um, but this is what it looks like. It's really, really pretty. I like the arrows on here. I think it's a nice like gender neutral kind of color scheme. I also got this. So, so cute. It's this little like bathrobe and it has uh, Winnie the Pooh at the bottom. Let me show you the little embroidery here. So cute. Oh my gosh, this was so adorable. That's what the inside of the hood looks like. I thought this was so, so cute. Oh, I loved it. So I got this and then I'll show you all the little outfits. These are just too, too precious. Um, starting with these little pants, <laughs> they're little gray pants with little um, feet, I don't know, footy things. So I got these little pants. And then there's ugh, these, all of these are so cute. And then I got these little joggers. Oh my gosh, look how tiny. So I got these. And okay, now, this is, now we're moving into my favorite. These are my three favorite items. So there were these adorable <laughs> little pants with Mickey Mouse on them. So, so cute. Oh, I'll tell you the sizes. Um, this is three to six months right here. Um, the little gray one joggers were six months. And these little pants were six months as well. So that's all the pants I got. And then I got, there's, I saw two of them in the bin and I grabbed both of them because I mean, all of this was for $3. Keep in mind, all the stuff I just showed you was $3 plus these two items were in the bag as well. So I got this one to match the pants. Are you ready for this? How cute this is? It's a little Mickey Mouse pullover hoodie. And look at the little hood, it has mouse ears. Oh my gosh, That I think this would be perfect for a boy or a girl, doesn't matter. The, uh, the little arm says Mickey Mouse on it. Uh, this is for three to six months here. So this will match the pants and it's like around, the, like it's the same size. Um, but I got this one as well. They, there weren't pants to go with this, but I, for $3, I had room in the bag. I just got the same, same adorable little hoodie, but it's in a size 12 months. So that way the baby can wear it even longer. <laughs> so um, all of that clothes I got for $3 clothes, blankets, towels, whatever, $3, such a good deal. And then the last thing I picked up at that same yard sale, she has this. Now I think I put this in the bag wrong, but it looks like <laughs> kind of like this. I don't know how to fold it back to the way she had it, but it, it works. It's this little bag, has a little like wrist thing. You open it up and it comes with like, actually like it, it's all together like it stays in one piece so this little bag is like connected and then you unroll it and it's this really cool little like mat you know so if you want to like take it with you when you travel I'll probably keep it in like the diaper bag but it's like this really pretty like black and white like little print I got this for a dollar fifty and that's everything that I got so far at the yard sales. So I'm happy with the stuff that I found so far that I've been able to buy secondhand. Um, I know we're gonna buy a whole lot more once we find out the gender, um, but I'm really happy that I found all these gender neutral items at the yard sales. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.